The water concerns continue in Siena Plantation in Missouri City. Last week, families described their water as strange smelling and strange tasting. Now some say that same water is giving them rashes. Channel 2's Marianne Martinez tonight with the story you'll see first on 2. Marianne? Well, Dominique, we've been working all day to get answers for these residents who mostly just want to know what is in the water that they believe is making them sick. Now, we reached out to Missouri City. They are ultimately in charge for providing water to this area. They referred us to Sea Environmental. That is the company who manages the utility, including the billing of the water. Well, they hung up on us twice when we called to find out what is in the water. I boil water and then I filter it, and then it goes in my little hand bucket. Um, and this is samples of the water over the last two weeks or so um, that's dated. Um, we, we found a, a place in Houston that will test the water for us and let us know what's in the water. Noreen Covey is no longer bathing with the water coming from her faucet. She switched to bottled water. She believes the water in her home is causing rashes all over her body, and she's not alone. Dozens of others are sharing pictures of rashes that sprouted since Missouri City and its water administrator, C. Environmental, switched over from groundwater to well water on January 28th. There couldn't have been that many things that we were all doing but we all have the same water company. So we, we pretty much figured that it, would, it could be the water. Shane Hawkins' seven-year-old son is dealing with rashes too. He says residents only want two things, a heads up next time the water source changes and a list of chemicals the water is being treated with. At least giving everybody the precautionary measures of what it's being treated with um, because not everybody's gonna react to everything the same. Now, again, Missouri City declined to be interviewed about this, but they did refer us to a statement they gave us on Thursday saying that the water is perfectly safe and that the normal water source, which, source, which is that groundwater, will be restored on February 14th. Reporting live from Siena Plantation, Marianne Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Marianne, thank you.